That looks like summer's over. Uh, I was lying in bed this morning, thinking, oh, don't want to get up, you know. It's, it's, late, it's Friday morning, and I hear the garbage truck, and I go, oh my God, I haven't put the in there. <laughs> I'm screaming out there, and I see the truck go past. I'm in trouble, Mrs. Mac is gonna kill me. And it was the green waste guy. And we don't have any green waste this week. So I snuck out with the uh, the recycling. And it's out there now, and he hasn't been. Scary. That is uh, probably the third time I can remember missing like sleeving in and not putting the bins out because I normally put them out the night before. Oh, that was incredible. Got it out. He still hasn't been. And I'm halfway through my first walk. And it is a beautiful morning, but it's crisp. Have a look at that, if you can see. Yeah, that's for sale, that block. They want... Uh, well, they want about 400,000 bucks. It's a lot of money. Out for a walk on a Sunday morning and look at the car. <laughs> That's incredible. Uh, I don't know, but there we are. Sunday morning, it is beautiful. And the sun is up just a little later this morning. And welcome back to the shed. Um, we've been in and out. We've had to cut grass and everything. And the lawnmower is over here. Got a little trick with the lawnmower too. I saw a guy in Wangaratta do that. Uh, and I'll show it to you. Well, actually, sort of. Anyway, it's time to uh, start getting these. Well, not quite yet. But it's, it's time to start looking and cleaning and blowing the cobwebs off our, our chainsaws. And uh, as you probably, if you've been watching the vlog, you know that we, uh, we're not allowed to go up the mountains anymore to get wood. We do have, however, a fair amount of wood here. I'm not sure whether we've got enough for 12 months. We normally go through of the scrappy wood that we get up on the on the uh, the mountains about uh, between eight and nine trailer loads, which is eight and uh, nine cubic meters of wood. That sounds a lot, doesn't it? And if it's good wood, like we've got down here in the, the, the backyard, we should go through about six in a season, but uh, we're, it's a bone of contention. Mrs. Max says we've probably got enough. I'm thinking we probably don't. <laughs> uh, we will see. We will see. But anyway, we're, we're going to clean off our chainsaws and uh, get that ready. Now, have a look at the, at the lawnmower here. I've got a little hack. If you own um, one of these, um, maybe you know about it, maybe you don't. But anyway, we'll get down to it and I'll show you. Okay. Now I saw a guy in Wangaratta and he was a he was um, a gardener, one of your local gym uh, franchise operators, and he had he had bored a hole in this flap. This is this is where the blades are. He bought a hole in the flap and he put a chain through it and hooked it up onto the the deck of the, the lawnmower so he could lift that up. Uh, what that does is that uh, allows the, the, the grass to come flying out in a spray rather than in a focused pattern. So if you don't feel like um, raking up the grass, <laughs> you open it up like that and it sprays it out and it looks fairly neat. Uh, now, that's one way of doing it. 
This is the Frank way of doing it, or maybe I should say the Michael way of doing it. This is a piece of wood with a mitered end. Now, the mitered end is very important, and I'll show you why. Here, if you can see, we have a little uh, kick-up flange. And this piece of wood... fits in there perfectly. And it does that. And that little mitered edge fits just nice on this sloped edge here. And it fits there and holds it up. And if it breaks, you just get an, another piece of wood. <laughs> that's, that bit there is steel, so you've got no problems. But that's what I do. On, obviously, I've, I've been mowing. I was mowing yesterday and I was too lazy to clean out the lawnmower and give it a wash, which we'll do today too. But that's what we've been doing with that and we've been doing it right through the summer. Amazing. Uh, anyway, there we are. Yeah, so what we're using is the TV as a monitor at the moment. I don't have a monitor. Um, so we're using the TV and you can see uh, the new editor, right? It, it was a free download, so it looks great too. But there it is. And um, it's a little bit complicated. It's a bit of a, bit of a learning curve actually. And uh, there's a few things that I don't understand and I'm, I'm doing my best to learn. And uh, anyway, so we'll get this video sorted and uploaded as soon as possible. It looks like it might be a long one too. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and share. That'd be terrific. And uh, we'll catch you in the next video. We'll see you then. Mm -hmm.